It's actually very nice, mom. I should come home more often for a decent meal. Well, you know that will make your mom very happy since we hardly ever come home. You should be ashamed right now. You should, yes, you should, you should cover your face. You want to be coming home often for my food when you should be the one cooking. I mean, shouldn't you start to learn how to cook for your husband? Oh my God. Uh, chill out, mom. She's only 20. It's never too early to learn. And you wonder why I don't come home? You know, so. Hmm? No, sorry, okay. There you go again with your mm -hmm. so it's okay. By Bello do so it's okay. Well, as long as me, uh, I know you do not like us making phones on the table, but please come out. Okay, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Hello? Oh, it's ready? Please just forward it to my email. No, 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 no. I can't wait. Just send it to my email. Thank you. Sorry, Dad. I wonder why mom thinks I don't know how to cook. Mm. You do? Of course, I'm your daughter. Mm. I'm just not really a kitchen person. I see. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. By tomorrow, by the time you'll be pounding yam. Yes, you love to cook. We'll see you tomorrow, you're pounding yam with a goosey soup. Who's pounding yam? You. You'll be doing the pounding, I'll be watching you. <laughs> Let's see how good you want to make it. Looking at your lab results right now, sir. Thank you, thank you, sir. Busayo, can you please come in here, please? Ah, doctor, you sent for me. Yes, please sit down. Sure. Mr. Janako, can you scan this to him? He wants it ASAP. I think we have his email address. You do have his email address. Yeah, Wonderful. Wow. Oh. My dear. It's sad, isn't it? You know, growing up, Daron used to be like a very good friend. I mean, his dad used to be like the father of the year back then. And uh, everybody wanted a dad like his. It's just... Why, why is he chasing shadows and torturing himself? <laughs> chasing shadows, you say? The man simply wants to know who his real father is. <laughs> And you call that chasing shadows? Sir, <laughs> go for big batting. If I was in his position, mm. I would just let Clipping Dog lie. <laughs> but sir, your, it's easier said than done. Mm. And like you said, if you were in his shoes, which you are clearly not, so it will, we would never fathom, understand mm. what this man is going through in his head. Dear all my guy. My dear, please scan those documents across to him, please. And uh, blind copy me in the email. Okay? No problem, sir. You can leave now. Thank you. Hmm. Okay. You okay? I'm fine. You just startled me. Startled you? How? You ask so many questions. Um, darling, uh, um, 
Do you know who your brother was talking to while we were at the table? Nope. No idea. Do you know where he is? No, I don't. Do you know where he is? I just told you I don't know where he is. What's wrong, Mom? You look pale and shaken. Oh, Madame, 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 Madame. What? Don't worry, okay? You don't need to get caught up in this. I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. Okay, now, Mom, you're scaring me. What's the problem? Talk to me. Dad and your brother are. No, I don't know where they are. Can you please find out for me? Please? I'm not going to get rid of me so quickly, Mom. Tell me what the problem is. Look at you. Okay. All right. Um, sweetheart, I, I promise to tell you everything. But you have to help me find out what your dad is doing, where your brother is. Okay, okay. Fine. Okay. Fine. I'll look for them. Uh, fine. Dad has dozed off on the couch. And BD me said Nero went out to get something. You want to tell me what the problem is now? Sweetheart. Do you, do you know why your brother came home? No, I have no idea, mother. Okay, come here. <sighs> you know, your brother came home because Oh my goodness, you, you're my daughter. Right, I know that. And I love you. I know that too. Your mother. I know that. He came home because... Hello. Hi. Uh, can I sit down? If you want to. <laughs> Are you here waiting for someone? What's your name? Come on, say something. I'm just trying to be friendly here. Oh yeah, pack your thing and go to reserve table. I beg. <laughs> you don't see this for bowlers. <laughs> Carry your two naira over and go to that table. See you. You don't know the sweet boyfriend guy. Smell my pet, Paco Raban. <laughs> Yo, Carry your thing and go. I'm speaking for net for you. Everyone doing. Be gone. Leave. Leave. <laughs> you gone. I don't have time for this. Sister? Eh? What do you say? I want to left. You can't even speak. You want to left. <laughs> if you want to leave. <laughs> Sister, if you want to leave, now if you want to left. <laughs> Yo, G, come and hear this babe. See that babe? She wants to, she wants to phone for me. She said, please, 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 I'm not even in, 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 in the mood for that. You know the kind of stress I went through to get those samples. I practically begged him to cut his finger you know, with the silly, silly vanity kit I bought for him. Where do I go from now? Wait, uh, maybe uh, there was a problem with the specimen. You Dude, know, never... there was absolutely nothing wrong with the specimen because the doctor told me he was fine. He's simply not my father. Guy, why are you gingered like this? Did you want him to be your father or what? Don't, you don't get it. You don't get it. I've been anxious. I've been expectant about this result. I, I, look, I was having dinner with the, the, with the family last night and then the, the doctor called me and told me the results were out. Look, I couldn't wait until Monday. I told him to send the results into my email. I did not finish eating dinner yesterday night. I had to go check it and, 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 and then look at Guys, where, where do we go from here? Bale, your anxiety will kill you. Calm down now. Calm down. Come, Nero, if I didn't know you any better, it looks like you're actually praying this guy is your father. Look, it's not, it's, that's, not, that's not it. Look, I'm glad Uncle Lekon is not my dad. But it just simply means that I, I will have to keep looking. 
I mean, I've been on this for, for months and it's, it's, it's tiring. It's exhausting physically, emotionally. The search will just have to keep going on. It's okay. It's okay, bro. I'm there for you whenever you need me. But meanwhile, see that babe. I want to give you a gist. I came here, normal sweet boy French guy, Paco Raban smelling. I say hello, hi. She not say anything. And then start to squeeze her face. I say Kuro. See, uh, she went to go and buy those uh, 200 naira zobo and pour inside glass. She think I did not see her. Now when she was going, she now form and say I want to left. <laughs> she she messed up. She said. Wait, wait, wait. What did she say? I swear. She said. Uh, excuse me. I want to left. <laughs> she broke my. Head. Uh, you didn't say it. <laughs> what? You did not say let me left. I'm coming. You want to lie that you don't yeah, let me left? Okay, okay, you want to lie you don't let me left? It's okay, it's okay. Let me left. Let me left. Uh, you can't get away with it. I have gone to charge you and your sister. Oh, uh, no. Uncle, that ain't no problem. That ain't no uh, problem. You see, we just want to get to know more about Mumsy when she was a lot younger. Mm. And, um, you know, some old friends she wouldn't mind seeing at the surprise party, you know. Mm. Ah, that's, uh, that's going to be a long list. Oh. But don't worry, I will, uh, I will give you the link to those people I'm still in touch with, okay? That's, that's great. Huh? I really appreciate that also. Uh, not to worry. Good. Look, your mother is a very valuable woman to me. Ah, I don't joke without. <laughs> uh, hmm. you, know, you know what? I am going to tell you something that I've not told anybody in a long time. Okay, uncle. Hmm? See, your mother and I, we got very close to what she moved in with us. That is, your dad and I, we were staying together back in the U.S. there. We got very, very close, you know? Well, we got close. But uh, not too long after she moved in, your father had to travel back to Nigeria for his father's burial, my uncle. Uh, your father left her in my care. That I should take care of her while she was away. Well, on the day of his trip to Nigeria, I drove him to the airport. On my way coming back, the police stopped me. You know how this US police are, can be sometimes. Uh, they searched the car and uh, found, um, uh, they found marijuana in my car. Uh, marijuana? Yeah, well, uh, you call it useful as Oberon's back in the days. <laughs> anyway, to cut the long story short, uh, I was arrested and detained. <sighs> Your father had just traveled. There was nobody for me to call. <sighs> the only person that I could come up with was your mother. I had no choice but to call her. Ah, your mother. Wonderful woman. Oh, wait, uncle. No, no, let me tell you. She was able to get a lawyer for me. And the lawyer was able to, you know, bring down what I would ordinarily have gotten as a sentence for being a first time offender. So, I went to jail. Yes. <laughs> then, after I was released. Uh, oh, wait, wait, Uncle. Are you trying to say now that? After my dad left for Nigeria, and for those two weeks he was away, you, you were not even disposed to stay with mom because you were in jail? Yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, I'm not too proud of it. <laughs> the irony of it is your father left her in my care for me to take care of her, but she turned out to be the one taking care of me. Anyway, after leaving jail, uh, I was sent to rehabilitation, drug rehabilitation center. When I got out, based on all that that happened, my parents sent for me to come back to Nigeria. So I ended up in Nigeria. Then one day, I think 
I was I was in my father's office, you know, because back in the days there was only civil service uh, people that had phones yeah. and you know cell phones. Yes, and, and uh, we didn't have the <laughs> the luxury of cell phones like we have it now. So. Was that that day your dad called and said to me that uh, your mother was eight weeks uh, pregnant? I was very happy for them. I even told him, I said, look, keep that woman. She's a wonderful woman. Now, Don't lose her. Uncle, I, I need to get it right again. So you mean to say that you came back to Nigeria before my parents? Oh, yes, yes. And as a matter of fact, before and during their wedding, you were not present? <sighs> <laughs> I couldn't. I, there was no way I could. I, I was back in Nigeria. I mean, it wasn't something I'm proud of. He paid me, but <laughs> what it was, it, what it, it was what it was. I mean, there was nothing I could do. Uh, but you will now understand why I say your mother is very, 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 very valuable to me. I don't joke with her at all. Well, all that is past now. I just need it for you to know. <laughs> all right. Back to your mother's uh, surprise birthday party. Yes, mommy's surprise birthday party. Yeah. Oh, look. The numbers, maybe the old uh, friends. No, don't worry. I, I, will, I will give you all the links. Eh? Like I said, I'm there for you. Just ask whatever you need. I'll do it for you. Thank okay? If only I had been patient enough for Uncle Lekon to finish up his story the other day, I'll still be 200,000 naira richer. I need to stop all this rat race and talk to my mom. She needs to start talking. Darling, I, I was an intern, and he was my boss, and he was married. I, so I know it wasn't meant to be. He know I exist? Um, uh, no. At first, I, I wasn't sure if I was pregnant for your dad. But when you were like a, a year old, I, I, I started to notice a lot of similarities between you and him. And so I, I, I couldn't say anything. I had to keep all those observations to myself. You know, darling, it, it's difficult. And you know, you didn't, you didn't deserve all of this. And I was all ready to lose my, my home, you, my husband, this marriage. Everything is out of respect for your dad. Wait, so dad never suspected anything? I've always known. See, it's, it's, it's funny and strange, right? But I've always known the truth. Ah. I often wondered who that could be, but I, I just didn't know. Wait, Dad, I don't understand. I, I don't get it. So, you knew all this while and you kept quiet? You, you never challenged Mom? Son, see, what you need to understand is that I've always been hopelessly in love with your mom. And I knew I would marry her one day. But I wanted to deal with my demon before I, you know, before I could you know, get married. Love it. Yeah. I always loved you. I love you so, so much, darling. No, Dad, no, no, I, 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 I just don't get you. I, hold up, I don't understand you. What do you mean by demon? What demons? And, and why did you keep quiet after all these years? Mom, what demon? Answer me! I, I, I don't know.
So my life has been a lie all this while, what? and Dad, you helped to cover it up now. A lie? What lie? Well, wrong. You are not Janaku, and nothing can change that. Do you understand? You know. And as for my demons, so I explained that to you. Shortly after I met your well, mother, my flatmate then introduced me to this uh, fertility clinic where he was making extra cash by donating his sperm. Yeah! Damn, man! I can't believe you won a game. When it comes to this game, I'll get whooping your ass. I'm getting game land next week. You should come over next weekend so we'll launch it up together, okay? Next weekend? Yeah. That won't be possible, bro. My girl is coming into town, man. Mm. Wait a minute, dude. Yeah. Where do you get the money you spend on video games and fancy stuff? Hmm. Hope you are not into credit cards. Credit what? Don't be tripping, man. Don't be tripping. Making sure they all, making sure they are all, just smart. <laughs> what do you mean? Okay, there's this dude at my night job. He told me about his spam bank. I go there a few times in a month to donate and I get my extra cash. That's all. Really? Yeah. Is that even safe? <laughs> What's the safe about it, buddy? Come on. They give you a pump magazine, a bottle, and a room. It's as simple as that, man. Hmm. If it's that simple and straightforward, I think I'm interested. Okay. Hold up. As long as you got no disease, because your spam will be screened for infection. Once it's all good, <laughs> trust me, man. The door keeps rolling in. For real? For real, bro. <laughs> <laughs> well, I won't tell this to a cash, too, so. Boy, this is your spam guy. As calm as man. Really? How do you mean? They didn't pay me now. They said my spam can be used. One thing, one thing. I'm lost here. I don't get it. It says something about Azuspenia. Why don't you let's just forget it and Man, you need to check up for yourself, bro. <laughs> you need to check up for yourself. And I was devastated when I found out that um, I had low spam count. No. What? No, 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 no. Please. Uh, Demola, don't, don't even go there. Don't say that. You, you're Toy's father. She's your daughter. I swear to God, she's yours. I mean, I couldn't have done that to you. Not, that, not, not again. Urala. I never said she's not my daughter. I'm not just my daughter. They are both my children. Luckily for me, what I was diagnosed with was called uh, obstructive azuspamia, you know, which, is, which is due to untreated uh, infection. You know. And I said, fortunately, because uh, it's reversible through surgical means. You know. And so you can, you, can, you can imagine my excitement when, uh, when I came back and then and you told me you were pregnant. You know. Oh, I said, I was happy. You know, I, I thought maybe the doctor was wrong. So I didn't even seek any second opinion. You know. Uh. Oh my God, I'm finished. I'm so finished. No, no, hold up, hold up. Well, Dad, I, I still don't understand. So, you kept quiet all this while, even you knew I was not... What? So, mm. have I ever, at any time, treated you like I'm not your father? Mm. Or no. like you're not my son? Well, no, Dad. You see, but... There is no but. You are my son. And as for Toya, she's my daughter. Because, uh, see, shortly after we had you, your mother couldn't get pregnant. So I was determined to go to this reversal procedure, you know, to go through with it, you know. And uh, I went through first opinion, second opinion. I even seeked third opinion. And that was when uh, my worst uh, fear was confirmed, that I was actually shooting blanks. And then the, your, your mother was uh, pregnant with her, with Tony. I was heartbroken. You know, I just thought, my wife must be having an affair. You know, where we're together. You know, it was all broken. But the child was born, and she looked like a carbon copy of my mother. Now, even a blind man would know that this is my child. You know. No, I don't understand. 
I, I don't I don't understand that. Mm. I just simply don't understand. Oh my god. Why don't you understand? Oh. Everything, Dad. See, just calm down. Maybe when you begin to have your own family, you can understand. And if you insist in uh, pursuing the, uh, the quest of finding your biological father, you know, I, I give you, you have my blessings, okay? Oh and I will always love you. Oh my God. You know. Well, Dad, I'm sorry I raised my voice, but you see, I, as much as I do not really, really do not understand what you're saying, I still appreciate you. I love you, Dad. You're the only father I know. You've given me everything. You brought me up. Well, uh, I love you too. And there, there's nothing to be grateful for. I was just performing my duty as a responsible father. Okay, and I will forever love you too. Um, Mom. Yes, darling. I really think you owe Dad and I a whole lot of apology. I think you owe Dad more than you do me. Mom, well, first, I would like to meet my father. Not because of anything, but just to satisfy my curiosity and bring some sort of closure to all of this. But for now, I'll leave you and Dad to talk. I'll tell you both everything that you need to know. Yeah. Ah, He's right. I think it's time for us to have that long talk. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. You know that I love you. And I still do. And I love you like, like life. I love you every day of my life. It was the devil. I don't, I don't know how I can... Wait, can you believe there are over 200,000 Kevin Williams in the United States? Oh, yeah. Just have to narrow it down with the information mom she gave me. Oh. You don't need the name she gave you? She didn't give me much. She told me about the name of the company where they first met and his age, but even those ones, she's not even sure about it, so I just have to narrow it down. Wait. You really want to see this guy, eh? Right? You know, come to think of it, I just, I don't even know why I want to see him. Maybe, I really don't know. Maybe to look into his eyes and see the resemblance and, I don't know, call it closure. Wait, so you're telling me that you, Nero, you don't want to have anything to do with him, even though he's Jagaban that's collecting all the money? I will always be an Ajanoku, never Williams. It's just for closure. Uh, no shaking, but don't go and bring all those uh, owu stricken fathers and bring and come inside this house, I beg. But if it's like he's collecting toll gates from first and second toll gate, all that money, Baba, but adopt you, you have to say that. <laughs> Baba, we need rich parents in our life. We don't gotta be looking for all those who are streaking parents. Well, last time hmm. I remember, I because? Bought this with my money. Yeah, guy, stop now, stop. Stop. Don't joke like that now. See? That father you're looking for, oh, who will kill him? Oh, who will kill two of you together? Nonsense. Which one are you? Man. Look at that. Chris. He's African American. And that's only half of me. That makes me mixed race. 
Do you know how difficult this is for me? Why do you have to make a joke out of everything? Uh, calm down, man. Farabale, person who they play with you no, again. No, 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 no. Person who they play with you. Look, I know your mind is like a, a roller coaster right now, but you need to calm down. Look, at least you even have a clue who your, your papa is. Look now. See, look at this part. Hey, check out his... Uh, his nose even look like your nose. <laughs> All those AC news that used to suck, God. <laughs> yeah, it's no bad. No bad. Honestly, you're so strong. Like, I knew that you were strong, but I didn't know the level of your strength. You are strong, big brother. I won't lie. Uh, well, it wasn't easy. But you know what they say. A man's got to do what a man's got to do. I know, right? Mm-hmm. But how's that, though? How's he taking it? Not easy. Not easy at all. But he's a strong man. I'm sure he'll be OK. I'm still in shock with mom, like. Right. You know what? Enough about mom and dad. Let's talk about you. What's up with the wedding plans? Oh, not again. <laughs> Let's talk about <laughs> it. Whoa, hello. Oh, mama. Yeah, yes, we are. We are. Sorry for keeping you waiting. So. At least, we thank God it was not, it was not so difficult finding it, you know? Well, if you call spending two weeks not so difficult finding him, well, you're right. And if you feel the number I have means finding him, then again. <laughs> grumpy old man. Look, I'm not grumpy, okay? I'm just tired. I'm tired. It's been two months in this country and uh, I don't even know where I'm heading to. But thanks anyways, you know, for helping me with the search and all that. I got you, bro. Brothers for life. So, when are you flying out? 10.45 p.m. tomorrow. I hope you visit soon. Soon, brother. Soon. After this personal trainer, give me a massage. Personal trainer Linda. <laughs> Guy, you talk to this. <laughs> she likes you. Hi, is this Kevin Williams, please, of the Western Internationals? Okay, uh, I'll just, I'll just say it, okay? Uh, um, we're all our Dorothy's son. I don't know if you remember her, but I was told you're my father. would like to meet with you. <laughs> 